ask me today, my 86th birthday, what has the ballet given to me? To me, them Katya Nikersov. <laughs> or as I later became known, Pushova. <laughs> I will tell you. I was born in Omsk in 1896. The same year my father, Serge Anurak, <laughs> met my mother, Nida Pulova. They were a very close-knit couple. <laughs> when I was a mere slip of the tongue, just a child of 17, I remember I was sitting quietly with my mother. I was feeling relaxed and happy while I had just been to the Urals. <laughs> When my father walked through the door, my mother looked up and said, why don't you look where you're going? <laughs> Bolshoi was on his <laughs> And soon we found ourselves sitting in the orchestra stalls, watching a performance of Coppelia. It was my first taste of the ballet. I was enchanted. What particularly caught my eye was the performance of the male lead, Sergei Burgess. <laughs> In his body-hugging tights, he was quite outstanding. <laughs> How I admired his hidden virtuosity. I longed to play with him, but I realized I would have to learn to dance first. <laughs> so, I enrolled to the Vladivostok School of Dance and Ways of Making You Walk. <laughs> the principal was the Mkacha Galina Barishnikov, KGB for short. But not for long. <laughs> there I learned the first position, and then on to the second, the third, the fourth, and of course, the wonderful fifth. And all this time I was working my way through the plie, the jeti, the fuete, the padasha, what a canteen that was. <laughs> I went through the chorus, the corps de ballet, the understudies. It was exhausting, but most enjoyable. <laughs> and of course, the harder things became, the more I enjoyed them. <laughs> but, you know, I had my moments of doubt. Some nights I would stand in the wings, and listen to the audience and wonder, would it ever be my turn to get the clap? <laughs> <laughs> and then I was invited to join a touring company. My dream had come true. One night stands all over Russia. <laughs> Those were wonderful days. The sheer grind of performance again and again, time after time, and then, at night, the theater. <laughs> <laughs> I became particularly close to the choreographer. I think what attracted me was the rippling delta, it's the incredible biceps, but most of all, the gleaming smile beneath that luxuriant mustache. She and I became firm friends. <laughs> it was through her I met the legendary Vladimir Shevalyakov which is Russian for stallion. But more of that in a moment, as he used to say to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the names that come back to me. Ashton, Helpman, Nureyev, great partners. I only wish I'd danced with them as well. <laughs> and of course, Nijinsky, Nijinsky. The greatest jump I've ever experienced. <laughs> when he went up, he went up. <laughs> Just to think of it brings tears to my eyes. <laughs> Those were wonderful years. And you ask me, what has the belly given to me? I will tell you. Endless pleasure. Seventeen grandchildren. And a funny walk. <laughs>